Leora, thanks so much for joining us. It's a pleasure. Thank you for inviting me. Yeah, I'm excited to talk to you because we're going to talk about 7AI, which is one of the most exciting startups in the Boston tech scene. And let's face it, AI is advancing at an insane pace. And 7AI is working on the future of cybersecurity. So let's talk more about the company. So first, it's super exciting. Um, I had the, the pleasure to build many companies in the past. Um, and the last one was Cyberism. and I built it for 12 uh, years. And I said, and for me, it was about the team that we build there and the ability kind of to have the right people in order to build the right company. And right now, we believe that there is a rare opportunity in the cyberspace to leverage an AI in order to solve one of the biggest problems that we have. So if you think about it, Right now, in the cybersecurity space, we're lacking 3 million people in different types of position across kind of the board. So if you are, are working in a company and you are a defender that your job is to protect the company, probably you're doing a three people job in order just to you know, make the day. So in our point of view, um, we ask ourselves, that can we change this paradigm? Can we create something that will enable those people to do their job faster and better. But this is not just it. It's like when you look at what hackers are doing, and this is fascinating, they're starting to adopt Gen AI in such a pace that basically whatever kind of push that we had on those teams and whatever push and the amount of alert that they needed to deal on the daily basis, we're gonna see it increasing and increasing and increasing and increasing. So. Now we're in a very unique situation that it's like 3 million jobs are lacking, so we cannot hire fast enough in order to deal with the problem, and the problem becomes bigger. So we were thinking, what can we do in order to help all of those defenders out there? And basically what we are creating, we're creating a system that can digest massive amount of alerts, understand them in real time, and run a full investigation like a human being will do and basically solve the problem and reach to a conclusion if something is a false positive or something needs to be investigated more all the way to remediate the problem and to take it away. So think about it. In many cases, we want to take people out of the loop and shift people up to become kind of what people are good at. And it's basically doing the more sophisticated stuff. So take the toil and the boring work out of kind of the day to day. We're going to talk about your your funding announcement that you you announced recently. But like, where where's the platform at? Like, have you actually like do you have a product? Do you have customers? So think about it. We started in February, and usually people are saying, "Oh, you're in a seed stage. You're probably still building the solution, and you go to market some sometimes next year." And in our case, that's not the case. So at the beginning, we took 10 people, 10 weeks, and we already built an end-to-end -end solution that we're already shifting to the market. So we're already engaging with the list of design partners. And when usually candidate is coming to us, we, we can demonstrate the solution for them. So they will be able to feel that it's actually real. But this is kind of the experience that our customers are already getting right now. And this is, to be honest, the fastest kind of go-to market and go-to-the-market that I saw ever. Now, in terms of the current state of the company, you did announce a seed round of funding. So talk about those details and you know the, the current state of the state of the company. So basically, out of the gate, we took $36 million as a seed fund. And some people ask me why we took so much money. I believe that right now the market is moving so fast that you have to leverage any, any advantage that you have. And the ability to have access to the right capital and build a company right from the get-go, this is what we're leveraging this money. Uh, we engage with basically the best investor that, uh, uh, that exists right now, tier one investor. So the lead investor was Greylock from the West Coast. We had Charles River Ventures as well as part of our cap table. And we have Spark Capital as part of the investor. So for us, this is a fantastic to have three major investors basically supporting us and enable us to move into the market as fast as we can. And I think it's a testament to see those investors backing 7AI. And one of the things I'm really excited about as relates to your company is the founding team is uniquely qualified to solve this massive, massive problem. Uh, you know, you talked about Cyber Reason being your prior company. So this is a founding team that has the background and credibility to build something that's going to be a, a large anchor company? So it, it, 
if you think about kind of the curse of the founder and usually the first time founder is you need to learn so many things. And every time that you learn something, you're already perfected and it's irrelevant. And now you need to learn something new. But there is something very unique when you do it the second time or the third time. It's like you can take all the learning and say, okay, how I'm going to build it the best right now. And this is a little bit about the fact that how you hiring people and how you bring kind of the best version of themselves into the company, how you generate an environment that meritocracy is the, the, the thing that actually lead everything. And, and basically you take all your learning into one thing and, and you create the best company that you can. So think about us, we're coming with a deep background of offensive cyber operation, then many years, more than 12 years at Cyberism of building one of the leading cybersecurity company. But right now we're looking around and saying, it's like, okay, let's take all the learning, implement it into new company and creating something so unique. That enables us to attract a very talented people right now. We are 25 people. And I looked around every morning when I see the, the team and I'm like amazed. And, you know, people that will join us, I, I believe that they, they will be amazed as well because it's a great people, great human being, but great professionals as well. Uh, so for us is, is really be able to build the right team here in Boston. This is something that I'm so excited and super, super passionate about it. Well, once someone does join the team, what's it like to work there? What's the, the culture like? So I'm really about the people. And when I'm saying about the people, it's not just something, and usually people think about values as kind of a list of core values that you're writing and put it kind of on the wall and say, this is our values. But I, I think about it a little bit differently. I think about it as, think about you want to build the elite team, the choose your sport. It can be football, it can be basketball. Uh, probably today, basketball, we're winning a little bit more. Uh, but think about the elite team that you are building. So you basically want to have every player to be the best that they can. So think about meritocracy. You want the best of the best, but they cannot work as individual. That thing has to work together as a group, as a team, in order to achieve a goal. And this is kind of the thing and the way of thinking about how to build a company. We're actually hiring the best of the best. We, we don't care about kind of any background or uh, or anything that you will think about it so it's like pure meritocracy bring the best people but then make sure that they can work together as a team to achieve kind of the super bowl or the championship and in our case is basically to win the market and create something new to the customers to the defenders to be able to protect their companies better now top tier talent they always have options regardless of market conditions so why should 7ai be on the radar for that top level talent I think that we, we live in a very rare um, situation in the market. And I have to be humble, but I think that we are going to transform the way that people think about protecting organizations. So think about it, how it's feeling to be part of a company. And you, you, you choose your poison. It's like if you want to be part of Google early days or you want to be part of Meta early days. But what if you're one of the people that actually creating and changing the future and actually influencing so many people that their job is to protect their company. We believe that right now we are transforming and disrupting this market in such a way that when you look back five years, you will say it was obvious that somebody going to build this type of company. And as you can see, I'm super passionate about it because I believe that no matter what I did in the past 20 years, and it was a lot about offensive cyber and defense cyber, I think that Gen AI will change everything as we know it today. All right, so this company has all the critical ingredients that you need to be successful. A massive problem set, a uniquely qualified team to solve this problem, blue chip investors that have come together to also support this company and their mission. So you need to go check out their job listings on VentureFizz so you can be part of this early foundational team. Go to VentureFizz.com slash 7AI and you'll see their job listings there. Leora, thanks so much for taking the time to walk us through all the details on the company. Thank you so much. It's a pleasure to be here.